So Cam Harris gets us started off. Nathan Hurst with it just now in the middle of the field. He'll take the huck. He's got uh, Muraoka going deep and he makes the catch. As Harris with the disc now. But some new players. Uh, Bomber Powell, who's been a uh, uh, mainstay of the D-line. But of course, Akafumi Muraoka with a monster grab. Japanese rookie in the AUDL. Toronto is just in love with his quickness and you can see it right there on that play. Nathan Hurst going to the end zone for Muraoka. And you were mentioning some new players on the team. Muraoka making a statement early on with the immediate huck and a quick possession from the rush in contrast to Montreal. Take another look at Muraoka's play. Good position and Carroll dumps it off for McKnight. He goes up the field into the end zone for Muraoka who holds on through the contact. Andre Arsenault looking for a pick call. He's not gonna get it. And Muraoka gets another goal. I mean, two games against such two incredible teams, both on the road, you can't be too upset. Yeah, I, I, I agree. And I think that game against the Breeze is really gonna be the critical one. Oh, Muraoka with a saucy forehand. So I wonder if it's gonna cause the disc to hang. Another one. Another D. Akafumi actually uh, underneath that disc on the uh, first Toronto toss and comes back and gets the D the next time. And then they look to huck to him immediately. Cam Harris with the shot. Akafumi runs it down it's one nothing Toronto. Wide open. I mean, we were talking about his speed before the game, and what a great example there. Uh, is Toronto style ultimate really one of the creators of that split stack style? Oh, great What team. a bit. He wanted to throw that deep to Muraoka. Carroll, Muraoka. He's got Cam Harris in the end zone. Great cut by Wilkie Lewis. Looks like the Outlaws are widening their uh, bench to try and get some legs under them. Harris looking. Great catch by Miroka. Center to McKnight. Split stack. You got Yurid. Oh, Hawk comes out to Wilkie. Wilkie Lewis with the Frisbee. Back to Yearwood. Oh, and a great catch by Muraoka. Planting the, the pivot leg in. And the rush score again. 20 to 19. Swings it to Carroll. Carroll. Seven. Hucks it. As the clock hits zero, Arsenault. Wait, wait. There's a call on the field. The, the goal call is, is good. the goal. Cam Harris, he played the body so well there. Their defensive schemes. The veteran Thomas McKnight swings it over far side. This one sail went through the initial target, corralled though by Mora Oka. Just shy of the end zone, little backhand flip, toe straddling the side for the score, and an impressive start by the rush as they methodically and patiently work their way down the field. Of course, really growing as a player. Looking end zone, Mora Oka comes down with a catch. Kurt, he is not the biggest guy, but he can play big, and he has so far this year for Toronto as a rookie. What, if anything, Kurt, do you think Madison can try to flummox this Toronto offense that, for the most part, has been steady as ever? This is one of the few deep shots we've seen from the rush, and it's Mora Oka who makes the grab in the end zone. That was a stellar play. We haven't seen a highlight like that from Akafumi. He really showed us his vertical leap right there. Gets up. Madison did a good job of, of poaching it, so it didn't work out, but Toronto flowing. Mora Oka to Carroll, showing the speed! Hey, 
These two professional teams have had some pretty epic finishes of their own. Two of the last three years, these two teams have gone to overtime here in D.C. as we see the steal from Moraoka, the quick flip to the end zone, and the rush strike again. McKnight, Kamir, Powell, Harris, Carroll, Moraoka, and Hurst. Moraoka to the end zone for Jeff Powell, and that's a gorgeous throw from the 25-year-old from Japan, Akefumi Moroka. Moroka is really playing well tonight. You see here, he's that first cut in the isolation play that the Rush love to throw, and then puts a beauty of a throw down the line to Powell. Young guy, really gelling well with the Rush. It has been so pleasurable to watch him play. Deep shot goes up, looking for Bergeron. Mora Oka there to pick it off. Uh, one minute to play in the first quarter. So great call by Coach Kedda taking a timeout, which was successful, paid out. Nice long pass by Toronto. Defensive when they put a double match on Bono. Harris. With the Hail Mary, and it's completed by who was that? Nura Oka, which we see a definitive connection between Harris and Nura Oka. Nura Oka. Now it's Carroll to Nura Oka. 15 seconds to play in the first half. Nura Oka looking for an, end, for an option. McKnight coming to point. Seven seconds to play. Will there be a Hail Mary? Yes, there will. The disc is in the air. It's floating. Lots of blue shirts. But it all was cut from the end zone. Less than a minute to play in this third quarter. Muraoka with the disc. Attacking the line. Two yards away from the point. A little floating disc. And it's confirmed. A 14 point for the Toronto Rush. <laughs> Carroll. To Muraoka, near the end zone. Muraoka finding his teammate. Uh, the the outlaws can apply some more pressure, get another D here. I feel like that huck from Bevan is something that has to come early or not at all. I and this huck right. comes up from Muraoka to Andrew Carroll, and he hops the disc just short of the goal line. Thompson McKnight with it, five yards out. Throws the break to space, and Andrew Carroll will clean it up for the score. Knight with, gets the disc to Cam Harris after a long run, and Harris is going to let one go. He's got Morioka, but Bevan is coming. <laughs> O'Brien's coming under him, but could not make the play as Morioka goes up and takes it. Carroll, not sure where he should put the disc. Gets it to Yearwood. Here with a nice high pop backhand to Morioka. Inside out, Scuba gives the defender a chance. Oh, what a grab by Hurst. Oh, Johnny, talk me through that point. <laughs> result in that open open hawk for McKnight. You're with the disc now a little further back. Gets it to Hurst, a nice high pop pass. It caught. It's called a goal. Hey, not sure about that one. Morioka with the catch. Refs call a goal. A pass from Nathan Hurst. Must have got his feet down in time, but uh, I think Harris is in a little bit of disbelief about how that played out, and uh, honestly, I can't blame him. So he'll start again. He's got the same look, same throw. Morioka this time. Carson Turner chasing once again. Same results. Great throw by Harris there. Just dialed up again, right? Just walk back 10 yards, put a little more juice on this hook, and still hit the end zone. As he was as he was cutting up line, there was a bit of a bump, I imagine. Yeah, it looked like contact might have been away from the disc. Oh, as Moroka looks for Nate Hurst deep. Great throw by Moroka. Hurst catches it a yard out of the end zone. Double team. And Nate Hurst looks for the hammer. 
to Yearwood for the point. So first things first. Still a little bit of rain in the area. A couple of drops here and there, which is leading to a slick disc. As Yearwood looks the disc into... Uh, sorry, McKnight looks the disc into his chest. Harris. Harris with an open backhand looking for Maroka deep. Maroka goes up and pulls it in. To Carroll. Nice fake to McKnight. McKnight looking deep for Maroka. For the point. Smooth offense by Toronto to go up 